Hi, it's Dr. Centeno, and today we're going to talk about why a fat graft is not a stem cell procedure. So many times my blogs and videos are really driven by things that happen in real life. And in this case, there was a uh, physician on LinkedIn who claimed that he was taking just some liposuction fat throwing it in a commercially available bedside centrifuge and was getting millions of stem cells per ml of fat, or actually, uh, in his case, two thirds of a million. So uh, is that fact or fiction? And the question is, how would we tell? Well, it turns out that at its simplest, fat stem cells are quite different from bone marrow in that unlike the latter, they're locked and imprisoned in a collagen matrix. So if we, if we look here, we see uh, the collagen in this case are these lines, and, and I've simplified some things here just to make this understandable for patients, but that's a stem cell, let's say, and all this stuff around it, these lines around it, that's the collagen matrix. Now, you can dissolve away that collagen prison with enzymes like collagenase releasing these cells. However, this is illegal per current US law. So many clinics just either centrifuge the fat to get rid of the oil and water and or chop it up very finely so that it can be injected. And clinics that do this will sometimes claim that this is a stem cell procedure. But we've tested all this really ad nauseum in our advanced research lab, and we are, were never able to get any viable stem cells using any of these kinds of approaches where you're just chopping up fat. And so the question is, why wouldn't that work? Well, take this fat sample from our lab that was chopped up so finely that it appears to be an emulsified liquid. However, it's not really uh, separated at the cellular level. It's really just chunks of microscopic fat. So no stem cells grew out of this sample. So we start out with something like this, which is a bunch of stem cells locked in this collagen prison. And we ended up with microscopic chunks of fat with the stem cells still locked in their collagen prisons. So we really didn't do anything to liberate the cells. So is a procedure that legally processes the fat a stem cell procedure? The answer is absolutely not. It's a microscopic chunks of fat procedure that doesn't release the stem cells from their collagen prisons. So thanks so much for watching. If you want to know more, go to Regenix.com and have a great day.